Hey guys, Jimmy here. Um, just wanted to give you guys an update on week two. We're opening week two with uh, two NBA players. Uh, I feel like we had a pretty strong week one and we actually got our first two cards back yesterday and today. So looking forward to getting more out this week and um, riding that momentum a little bit. So, and I apologize, I couldn't get the NBA video out yesterday because I had to tear down a fence in my backyard. Um, so let's take a look at our two guys. First up, we got Kurt Rambis. Um, I think he's kind of known for being on that Lakers teams, those Lakers teams in the 80s um, that won the championships and, and were in the finals with the Celtics every year of the 80s. And uh, to me, he's I really like Kurt um, because he was a hustle guy, you know, played super hard. And, he, you know, he doesn't really look the part, kind of a goofy looking guy um, with his Clark Kent glasses that have tape on the side there. Um, so pretty cool there. I'm really excited to write to him. Um, he has a video clip of him going up for a breakaway layup in the 1984 finals. And Kevin McHale comes over and just absolutely clobbers him, clotheslines him to the ground and a little scuffle happens there. And it's a pretty famous clip and a decently defining clip of that decade, considering the Celtics and the Lakers were that decade, you know, so Pretty cool there. Excited to write to him. Um, I think currently he's a uh, higher up in the Lakers organization. So pretty cool there that he came back to the Lakers. Um, so we'll see. I'm excited for him. The other guy we have is uh, Mark Aguirre. Um, started his career off in the early 80s with Dallas. You know, I think he was their predominant scorer. I think he averaged over 29 points one of the seasons. Um, and then he got traded to the Pistons for their back-to-back uh, -back championship run. Um, you know, the Pistons bad boys where they had the Jordan rules and um, whatnot. So, and he took a little bit of a back seat during those years and um, helped the D Detroit win back-to-back -back championships. And that team's, you know, pretty famous. So the uh, Pistons bad boys, Mark Aguirre, looking forward to writing to him and asking him about that. So these... These two will uh, go out tomorrow and um, we'll have an NFL day tomorrow. So thanks.